welcome home. All right, what's going on, guys? It's Epoxy, and here in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the mod Raw Input, the ultimate mouse sensitivity fix by IceKK. And this is an essential mod when you install Fallout 4 because it disables mouse acceleration, which, by the way, if you've ever done the INI changes, the B Force Ignore Smoothness equals 1, this value actually has no effect on mouse input and this is actually related to the lighting in the game. So that's not going to fix mouse acceleration. And the tweak B mouse acceleration equals zero, that value is invalid and 100% placebo. So those two INI tweaks will do absolutely nothing to get rid of mouse acceleration. You may have thought it got rid of mouse acceleration, but every single time you get on Fallout 4, it may feel a little off, and that's because it doesn't do anything to mouse inputs. And that's where this mod comes in. It disables mouse acceleration, but there are awesome other tweaks that it comes with as well, one of which is horizontal and vertical parity. If you guys have ever noticed while playing Fallout 4, when you look up and down, and when you look side to side, the sensitivity is different between horizontal and vertical and this solves that. And then it also has scalable ADS multiplier and normalized sensitivity. So this is the mod I'm gonna be showing you guys how to download and install. And then I'm gonna show you the results of it afterwards. The fact that I can actually even hit shots in Fallout 4 with my mouse. I feel like that alone kind of shows you that this does work because when Fallout 4 has the mouse acceleration on, when it has the horizontal and vertical parity, all of that bullshit, I can't hit anything. It's like I'm, I might as well be using a controller that has input lag. So anyways, we're gonna be jumping into this. This mod will be linked down in the description below so you guys can go ahead and jump right onto this page with me. Just go ahead and go to files on this page and we wanna use the mod manager download option and just click that and it will download into whatever mod manager you personally use. Now, I personally use Vortex and all we want to do is simply enable here. Now we get to choose a few options, which is pretty exciting with this mod as well. It allows you to customize a few things. So this right here allows us to choose our ESP or our plugin. And this just depends on what mods you have installed. If you're just running it the base game or you don't have any of these mods, you would choose vanilla. But if you have Horizon installed, you would use the Horizon plugin. If you have immersive gameplay, you would use that. Immersive movement, smooth first person sprint, 4%, 5%, 6%. You can choose any of those options if you have any of those mods installed. But I personally do not. I'm gonna be running the vanilla and we can just choose the ADS multiplier now. And this will allow us to change what the ADS multiplier is. Now, if you don't know what that is, so say I aim down sights and I have the 75%, it would decrease my sensitivity by 25%. So it is a useful feature if you like to be a little more precise when you're aiming down sights. And this is something I personally use in first person shooters as well. I usually go around the 50 to 75. I'm just gonna go with the default of 75 and hit finish, and then it will install the mod. And it's as simple as that. Now I wanna go ahead and show you guys the results. All right, so now we're in game and this feels so smooth, so responsive, and we're gonna go ahead and find some enemies. We're gonna drop them like a bunch of shitters as if we're playing Rainbow Six Siege, and hopefully you guys enjoy that. Come out, come out, wherever you are. This mod literally makes Fallout 4 playable. I, I stopped playing Fallout 4 for the longest time because of this, and oh my god, man. And it's at 75% too. This mod, you actually need to download it. You need to share it with everyone because when you feel it for yourself, when you feel the impact that it makes in gameplay and just mouse input in general, um, I can shoot a bird out of the sky. This makes Fallout 4 a million times better. <laughs> this me Being able to actually hit feral ghouls, which I would not be able to do without this mod, I mean I'm getting fucking shit on because, I mean technically they're getting shit on because I'm playing on very easy. And this makes the game actually playable for me now, thankfully. Like these raiders, I would be using vats on every single one of them because I would not be able to aim at a single one. But now I'm able to just run on in and just kill them all. Something I would not be able to do with the mouse acceleration because I am not used to mouse acceleration whatsoever. And this, this makes the game a million times better for me and hopefully it does for you guys as well but anyways that's it for this video if you guys enjoyed please smack that like button down below and subscribe to join the good fights if you haven't already it would be super greatly appreciated as always and until next time this is epoxy signing off yeah.